ora, everyone. Today I'm doing something a little bit different, and this is all down thanks to the local community Facebook page where I live. I'm going on a whale hunt, which sounds really super dodgy if you think of it in 1800s context, but here it means that there's actually some orca down in the local harbour. I've never seen orca up close, and I think it's such a cool opportunity to go down and have a look and see what I can see. So, thank you for joining me on this adventure. Let's go see if we can find ourselves some killer whales, which I should point out is a terrible name because they've never, ever had a recorded human death from a killer whale, just in case you were wondering. Okay, so I'm down at the Beach Haven Wharf, or just a little bit away from it. It's like half the community is showing up here, so I've got my mask to make sure that I'm kept nice and safe. Let's go see if we can find ourselves some killer whales. So I've just spoken to the ferry driver who you would have seen pop up before and they spotted the whales about 20 minutes ago uh, just up there past the North Harbour Bridge. So if they're up there there's very little chance of them coming back down here anytime soon with the way that the tide's moving. So, so whale hunting today was a little bit of a bust, but I have to admit it's kind of cool when the most exciting thing in the day is that you get to say you're going whale hunting and get to rush off down to the local wharf to do so. Um, they ended up coming back through about three hours later as the tide was taking them back out towards the coast. Um, it's one of those things they like to come in here because you can push stingrays up into the shallows and that's what they attack and eat. Um, so it's a great little hunting ground for them and there's bugger all boats out there in the kind of weather that we've been having in with lockdown so it's prime time for them to get in there. The one thing I will say I did notice though that was really kind of scary and one of the people that was there that I was talking to was just about how many people were walking around without masks and no social distancing. It just seemed to be one of those weird things that people are like, eh, it's over and done with. Where I am at the moment, there's a lot of cases. It's a hot spot. Local supermarket again was named as a location of interest yesterday. So it's one of those things that you really have to be very careful about. Um, and it's a shame to see people aren't masking up when they're out and about in public with other people. You don't have to wear them while you're doing exercise, but when you're around other people, you really should. But anyway, that was my big day out trying to hunt whales. I'm not very good at it, and I probably would have died in 1800s whaling times, but it's probably a good thing as well that I don't live in 1800s whaling times. Instead, I live in 2021, where instead of being shot by a harpoon, you're likely to be flamed by an anti-vaxxer conspiracy theorist. But hey, times they are a-changing. Anyway, that's enough for me today. I will catch you all tomorrow. Have a great day.